everyone. Today we're at Media Ocean interviewing Stephanie Dorman, who's the VP of Support and Training here. She's talking to us about how you need to mesh two contact departments together to form one beast of a department. Make sure you come visit her and see her speak at Call Center Week this coming June. Media Ocean is an advertising software company. Um, we actually claim to be a vertical software company because we provide software solutions for the advertising world. When I walked in the door, we they had just hired maybe 25 new support people with no strategy. They had no thought to hours of coverage, technology. They just said, we have a big client, we're going to have 10,000 new users, let's hire a bunch of people, and that's exactly what they did. So I just walked into this mess, and it was a, it really had gone from about 10 people to this now this huge group. If you're taking ownership of a mess, you have to set ground rules up front, and that's exactly what I did. I sat down with the folks who were interviewing me, and I, I laid it on the table. I said, I am going to need uh, technology. I'm going to need to make, be able to make some decisions about how we do some things. And I might have to spend some money to do that. But I will give you a business plan and I will give you reasoning behind that, but I need your support. And I made sure I had that support at, up front. And I'm glad that I did because I had to go back and point that out a couple of times. There were some times where I, I was pushed back on for, um, for new technology or for things that cost any type of money. One of the first things I did was cut out the training headcount right away. I, I pretty much did some, some quick um, logical thinking and realized that if we were bringing on a brand new client in a matter of months to try to go out and hire, onboard, and then train trainers was going to be a complete lost cause. Mm -hmm. So I focused on the people they had hired and we worked on getting them as much knowledge as possible and as short amount of time as possible. Um, the technology we were using was, was horrible, uh, basically, and we just did a bunch of Band-Aid fixes to it to yeah. make it work for client support, but it's not what the intention of the, you know, of the software was. So. Um, so we had to work a lot on process. There was a lot of process that we had to put in place, a lot of manual process. There was a lot of honor system, a lot of empowerment, a lot of trust. Um, and we, we succeeded. I think there were some times when we all thought we were going to lose our hair. Um, but we absolutely succeeded. We onboarded this client. We uh, developed a really strong team out of it. I think probably stronger than, than many teams that are built so quickly because of what we had to go through together.